Okay, these are fast notes on making the DC Universe online characters. Just because I don't have the time right now to go through and make videos of them. Um, okay. From what I've seen on the, in the game, let's start off with Robin. First, the color scheme is red is red and yellow and then maybe green or maybe black depending on what you want because you can only get three colors so you got to choose between the green or the black um all right well first i'd make him into a tall sprite or a small a small stocky character. The sprites are the smallest, and the second one is a stocky. So I'd either make him into a tall sprite or a small stocky character. Then give him the trench coat look. Give him yeah, give him give him that trench coat look. Make the trench coat red. And those little lines that are supposed to be the buckles, make those yellow. And if the trench coat turns yellow too, that's okay. I'm not sure because I haven't messed around with the designs of it yet. Um, I don't know what kind of gloves to give him. I guess just basic whatever type gloves maybe maybe the ones with the slot cut cut into them or the tiny tiny um formal gloves and then for boots maybe give him biker or those um high top yeah i'd, I'd give him the high top boots make those green And then give him a black, um, you know, the black mask or the green mask, you know, depending what your color spectrum is and how much you can, how much you have to work with. So, because I saw somebody with that design, I got curious. Um, because the mask is black, sadly I'd probably have to make everything black. Um, if the trench coat can have a letter R on it, I'd put it on the left side. Then, as for weapons and abilities, um, I'd give him a staff. You know, because from Teen Titans, Robin's always using a staff. He didn't use it so much in the an Batman the Animated Series, but it's good look. Give him the square utility belt, the, the square belt buckle utility belt, make that yellow. I wouldn't bother giving him any other kind because I don't like those other looks. And then as for abilities and powers, um, for movements, I give him acrobats, and for powers, I give him gadgets. And of course, for the weapon, he has a staff. Um, yeah, so there's that. Okay. As for making Johnny Test, which would probably be Johnny X, because he's always wearing that superhero costume whenever he turns into Johnny X. So I would look on. I'd look on the show pictures on Google or something for Johnny X. See what kind of a layout I'd give him. And match up the colors to that. And then give him the Fallout nuclear symbol. Because um, that's his little logo. He has on a shirt. Kind of makes sense because he keeps um, getting into trouble. So there's that.
Okay, as for, um, let's see now, as, hmm. as for the mask, I'd probably give him like um, half a mask where you can see his mouth. I guess I'd make his character type, um, maybe a tall sprite. And because he's supposed to be an 11 year old kid, so he'd, he would be small like that. Um, then, as for powers, he can do a lot of crazy things. He's got shape shifting powers, hurricane hands, laser vision. So, I'd probably give him. Oh, and then he has fire power, so it's a tough choice. Between morphing like an animal, fire powers, or ice powers. So that's a tough one right there. And then, hmm. as for the red, okay, so there's, there's Johnny and Robin's way out. And then as for making the red hood from Batman the Brave and the Bold, um... I'd give him formal, I'd give, I'd make the character tall, stocky, um, formal, formal shirt, um, formal pants, from, from, you know, formal everything, and make that all black. Make everything black, make the shirt on the inside white, and if it has a bow tie, Make that white, make that black too. Because this is um, the character with the red hood from Batman the Brave and the Bold, where there was a good version of Joker in that universe being the red hood. Which, honestly, after seeing other versions, I like that one a lot more. It's nicer. Um, so then, after that, after giving him the formal tire. And stuff, I, I think, um, for the hood part, what would I do with the hood part? Um, I think I'd give him a full, full mask that would cover everything up. Make his eyes white. And just give him that full, like, reddish mask and make everything black and white. And I'd have to color, you know, cu color to customize it for that. Then his abilities, because he's basically a good version of the Batman. Um, I'd give him, you know, because he's basically just a crime fighter, dressed up like a magician with no powers. I'd give him acrobat abilities. Um, gadget abilities and then for um, fighting abilities give him martial arts so it's basically the same as Batman but the, the costume and the figure are different and then here's a version here is a design for just basic, um, you know, just a basic person who's wearing street clothes. Give him bluish jeans, or, um, and it's different. This is a, the third character design. Okay, well, running out of time, so on to the next one. So this one was Robin and the Red Hood and Johnny Test.